Hey Warcats, we got Mr. Kosa here that's gonna help us out with the level one purple belt, okay? What we have is just techniques, no form yet. So the first thing we're going to show is a fixed stance. So go ahead and chum beam, Mr. Kosa. Okay, so an easy way to practice this, go in a straddle stance, so where both of your toesies are facing this direction, and then that this foot, uh, one of your foot, so we'll pick this one, is gonna turn at a 45 degree angle, okay? So just a reminder, one foot should be facing this direction, and then one will face the diagonal way. Alrighty, that is your fixed stance. Go ahead and pro. Okay, now we're gonna go into circular block. I know right now we're focusing on just the circle part. Okay, so we're gonna go down to the basic. So we're going to step forward, left front, or excuse me, step back into a left front stance. So since the left foot is gonna be in front, your right hand's gonna be the one that's circling. So you circle and then bring it up. Okay, literally just practice the hand Okay, good. Now, the way Mr. Kulse is doing it, this is the actual way, but right now we're just gonna focus on the circle. So just without the, yes. Okay, so you're just starting from the outside and then you're gonna circle in and out. All righty, so that'll be your practice. You can do an eight count drill as well. So chumbi, so let's try practicing the eight count drill on the other side. So now our right foot's gonna stay in front. This one's going to be, blocking so it's one go back to chumbi two three circle four five six and you'll go up to eight so that's the circular block vertical punch so if you notice now instead of punching sh straight forward here it's going to turn up okay it's going to be same foot same hand so mr Coles is going to step forward into a right front stance right vertical punch okay now on this punch your arm is not straight your arm is slightly bent at the elbow and then you're focusing on that vertical line of the punch okay so you would practice that with the eight count drill as well so go back to chumbi so we step forward one and two three four Okay, and then we go up to eight. Now we practice the other side. One, two, three, four. Alrighty, so that's your vertical punch. Next, we have a front snap kick turning kick with the same leg. So go ahead and go in a right back stance garden block. So the important thing about this, guys, when it comes to the turning kick part, that hip has got to turn over. Okay, so front snap kick, your whole body is going to be facing this way, but once you do that turning kick, your hips got to turn. Okay, so go ahead, one, so one, two, and then back. Okay, notice how his hip turns once he does that turning kick. Two, one, two, and then other side. Ready, one, one, two, good, and two, good and then back. Alrighty, Perot. So those are all your techniques for this month. Now, going into the self-defense. Okay, we have single lapel grab with the palm up, okay? So what's gonna happen is if I'm grabbing with the palm up across, his arm is gonna circle towards him first, around to catch the arm, and then trap it. So then from there, you can strike, knee, and then get out of the way, okay? So once again, if this hand's grabbing the lapel, the hand's gonna come all the way around the arm, trap it, and then you strike, okay? Now, same thing on the other side. If I grab on this lapel, he's gonna come all the way around. Notice he's coming towards himself first and then back. That's gonna be the, if y'all have any questions on that, guys, I know it's hard without a partner, but just go through the motions first, and then once we get back, we'll get with it, okay? The next one is the stepping two-hand punch. So basically, the attacker is just going straight towards him and pushing. All you're going to do is just move to the side, which is what we call redirect, okay? So as the force is coming towards, he just redirects out of the way. 
All righty, same thing on the other side. The force is going forward, just pushing through. All righty. So this is for level one purple belt. You all have a great day.